Hey guys, it's Phantoms Exo Center here, back again with another Phantoms Exo Center video, and today I bring you Donnie Exo Center X Casey Yonder you Love. Part 1 shall be linked, part 2 shall also be linked. Part 2 didn't really make sense because the only thing I can remember when I did a Donnie and Casey kind of rival Yandere was when you guys were doing the 7 Minutes in Heaven. I don't know if it, it yeah it was you and Casey Donnie like kind of pushed you and Casey into the closet and he was like uh you guys do seven minutes in heaven and blah 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 I can't remember what I said but it was like that take a sip of this coffee my coffee is actually cold so I'm sad I can go and warm it up real quick but I'm sad I mean but I'm scared oh my god and also sad <laughs> Microwave noises for your soul. Alright, we are back. I instead made some tea. Instead of warming up my coffee, take a sip of this tea. Mm. Delicious. <laughs> now, my Instagram, Discord, Link Server, SoundCloud, did I say Wattpad? I think. <laughs> and songs that I use will be all in the description below so if you have any song suggestions or would like to know what songs that i use make sure to look in the description and let's get straight to it okay so it's literally been four months since we left off the series literally you can go check it out it's literally been four months <laughs> since i posted part one and part two i think part one is almost five months ago but anyways, take a sip of this tea while it's still warm. Um, let's say you, uh, Casey and Donnie, have been dating for two months because I'm not going to make it that long. And they've been getting along just fine. They've, they've like been coping with each other and their presence and learning how to share you, let's say. <laughs> so every once in a while... You would go to the lair and check on the both. Of course, Casey would be playing video games either with Mikey or with Raph and probably getting beat, beat up by Raph. Donnie, as usual, in his lab, being a scientist, freak, <laughs> a little scientist, and working on his plans because my little head canyon is that 2012 Donnie would love plants. So, yes. And every once in a while, Casey or Donnie would visit you at your apartment with Fluff Law. <laughs> so this time, you decided to let them come over to your apartment instead of you coming every once in a while and visiting them to see what they would do. Of course, the first few days, your T-phone blew up with notifications from both Casey and Donnie, but you put it on mute to see what they would do. So the first POV is Donnie's POV. This was after he sent you almost an entire paragraph saying that he loves you and that he misses you and that you should come down to the lair. I'll take a sip of this tea again. <clears throat> I mean, if they're not gonna come down to the lair or anything or to my lab, then I'll go up there myself. And this is Casey's POV. Oh, man, are they really gonna make me go all the way up to their apartment with, with him? And then you, you, you just chuckled to yourself, laughing a little bit. Fluffball tilted his head like, what are you laughing at? <laughs> And you said to Flockball, well, I'm trying to get both of my boyfriends over here, so I can, we can have a little chat. Um, Flockball, of course, kind of face-palmed. <laughs> face-palmed, you get it? <laughs> that was a bad joke. Anyways, after like an hour or two, both of them came up to your apartment and they said, huh, there you are. Donnie being the first one to come up to you and give you a tight squeeze. Whoa, whoa, there, Donnie, be careful. Remember, I'm fragile. 
Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. He put you down. Casey just running up to you and giving you a big bear hug. It's been twirling you around a little bit. <sighs> I'm so glad to see you. Oh, dude, it's been so long. He spoke in a little boo-boo bear voice and just, you know, being all darling and cute. You decided to tease and say, well, Casey, I've never seen you like this before. He looked up at him, him being a, a little bit taller than you. <sighs> oh, shush. Donnie chuckled and said, well, how's everything been? No, I want to ask you guys that. How's everything been between you two? Casey, being the first one to blush and said, uh, Everything's been quite fine, actually. Oh, really? That's some good news. Yeah, yeah, hush. He would rub the back of his neck. Y you gave both of them this look right here that is up on the screen, wiggling around. So... Have you guys been up to any romantic stuff? What? Said Donnie. No. Why, why would we? He crossed his arms looking away. Yeah. Why would we? Um, Casey looked down at you with a weirded out look. I don't know. Just asking. You said looking at Donnie's neck. Bro got some. Some hickeys. Casey then noticed what you were looking at and said, Those aren't mine. <clears throat> then who are theirs? He raised the brow. <sighs> okay, look. He kneeled down a little bit. Yes, we've been getting along pretty well. And yeah... We've missed you to the point where we got along a little too well sometimes. Is that the case? You tilted your head. Maybe. Oh, dude, just For forget it. For forget it, okay? Donnie, next time, remember to put makeup on your freaking neck. Okay, okay, all right. Just don't get mad at me. Freaking punk. Call me a punk again and I'll give you a knuckle sandwich. Give you a taste of your own medicine. Oh, really? How are you going to reach up? I'm like seven feet tall. He, he looked up at Donnie. I don't care. I have my ways. Take a sip of this tea. You chuckled and said, now, now, let's not start a fight. So... Who remembers that one time that Donnie pushed me and you, Casey, into the closet, saying for us to have seven minutes in heaven? You sat down on the bottom bottom bunk bed. Donnie face palmed and said, Oh, Lord, here comes the stories. Oh, I remember for sure, Casey said, spinning in your little spinny gamer chair. Oh, no, not you too, Casey. It was all because he was jealous, he said, pointing at Donnie. I, I was not. You sure, bud? I mean, technically you had kind of a revenging voice at, at the time, two months ago. Let's just forget that happened. I mean, I wouldn't mind that happening again. Donnie gave you a shocked face as his jaw <laughs> dropped open. Yeah, me neither, said Casey, crossing his arms. Then he looked at Casey. Excuse me, he said in a dramatic voice, um, putting his hand on his chest, kind of like a Karen. <laughs> Both of you laughed your asses off, and he said, this isn't funny. Look, I've never had seven minutes in heaven before, okay? He said, like, twiddling with his fingers or something, doing the little shy thing. Then, why don't you have seven minutes in heaven now? Said Casey, with his eyes widening a little bit. Uh, uh, I... Donnie was speechless. 
you were still laughing and Fluffball was just confused. Look, let, let, let's let's let, let's change the subject, won't we? Um, well, listen, how's everything been around here, like with school, work, and yeah, everything's been fine. How's everything been down there? Oh, well, everything's been you know normal, same as usual. Huh? <sighs> yeah. Last night, Casey got beat up in street fight by Raph and Raph said he could flick him on the head and Casey ended up getting beat up by Raph. He said giggling, covering his mouth, did not, said Casey. Did too. <laughs> oh, yeah, maybe I did. And here's a little scratch as he left. Those don't look like scratches. You look the way giggling. Uh, you dirty minded possum. He said throwing a squishmallow at you. <gasps> Gasp. <laughs> you had this face right here. Did you just call me a possum? I am not a possum. You said throwing the squishmallow back. Him catching it before it hit his face. Moxie reference. <laughs> yeah, says you. You're our cute little possum. Or at least my cute. <clears throat> Excuse me, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Take a sip of this tea. Or at least my cute little possum. Well, what I would call them is my cute exotic flower. Why an exotic flower? Well, because they're an exotic flower? That makes completely no sense, Donnie, whatsoever. Is it supposed to make sense? I mean, is it supposed to be a technical pet name or a nickname? Would you call them an exotic flower all the time? No, exactly. He just sat there confused and like, okay, you two, let's not get started on pet names, shall we? I like any kind of pet name. Casey gave you a look. Any? Casey, don't you dare. All right, then. Lemon cardboard. <laughs> Before he could finish his sentence, Donnie just hit him with a cardboard, like a flat piece of cardboard out of nowhere. Cardboard that, Casey Jones. Where'd you get the cardboard from? You said in a worried voice. Uh, Infinity Pocket? He shrugged. Donnie, I'm going to beat you up after this. Try me, bitch. You face palmed and just gave Fluffball a few pats. Well, you too. You should be heading off now. Why? The two whined. I like you two want to snuggle on the couch. Bet, <laughs> said, said Donnie in a like competitive voice. Ho, 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 we'll see about that. You grabbed the huge fluffy banquet. Ba banquet. <laughs> going, going to the couch with a few pillows, snacks and everything. And you guys like cuddled up in this big blanket burrito. You turn on some Netflix. Netflix and chill. <laughs> Take a sip of this tea. And you guys picked something scary to watch. Of course, Casey, not being scared since he probably already watched the movie. Chucky reference? I think so. <laughs> Donnie being the scaredy cat, he was hiding his face most of the time and didn't want to watch. Especially when he heard screaming. You done hiding your face yet? Said Casey. Is it over? Yeah, the movie's been over. You've been snuggling into my shoulder since the movie started. Oh. Oh, I... You let go. I see. I, I, I see. You chuckled and said, Wow, you two are something, aren't you? No, we're not. 
I think you two are some kind of power couple. The two looked at each other, then looked at you, and said, Ew. Ew. You won't be ewing when I won't visit you guys for three weeks. Oh, come on, don't do that to us. Yeah, listen, that's not fair. You, you raised your eyebrows and said, Really? They looked away for a moment. Yeah, really. <sighs> you do. You guys should have just told me that you're gay. <laughs> you pulled out a little LML. <laughs> gay of five, which means male of male. Both of their jaws drop and Casey said, I'm pan. And I'm it, bisexual. And I'm bisexual. And I'm poly pan and everything else you said waving your flag it was like kind of like on a stick <laughs> fluff ball was just giving a little smug face and you're like america oh, yes yes you got us but we love you too and you know that donnie said cupping your face giving you a few smooches mwah, mwah, mwah. Say some for me, said Casey. Come here, you little possum. Mm. <sighs> Call me a possum again. I'll be hitting you in the hip. Kiss bit. <laughs> <sighs> I'll get you next time, Jones. Or will you? He said in a seductive voice. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, Jones. You got your turn. Whatever, I just... <laughs> he had a little pouty face. What are you pouting for? You asked. Nothing. Don't tell me you're jealous because Donnie wants to give me more attention than you do. I want to give you more attention than he does. He yelped. Aw, oh, really? Prove it. When Donnie finished that sentence, let me tell you, that man just kind of pounced on you. Whoa. He was giving you smooches everywhere, just snuggle, snuggle. Maybe a few nibbles here and there. Cough. Alright, 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 that's enough, that's enough. You get off before you get a little bit too attached. He yoinked Casey off. But I'm already attached. He whined. Yeah, yeah, we all are. My turn, Donnie said as he clinged on to you, cheering and giving you some nibbles and kisses too. Okay, okay, you two, you guys love to kiss he marks all over me when you don't even have lipstick on. Who says we don't? Um, Donnie pulled out these two lipsticks, which you had black lipstick marks and purple ones. Which, both of the lipsticks were clear, but as um, they rubbed it like on your wrist a little bit, because of the warm temperature of your arm, it showed the color. You looked up at Donnie and said, you cheeky little scientist. Mm -hmm. And then um, Casey got up with his <laughs> clear lipstick, quote unquote. Who says man can't use lipstick? He did the little gay hand thing. <laughs> the slay. And then Donnie decided to be more gayer than ever and said, Ooh, slay girly. You were laughing your ass off once again. And you said, You guys want to spend the night over? I'm kind of lonely. And then Casey shouted, I thought you'd never ask. Shh, quiet down, Casey, said Donnie. You guys cuddled up in your bunk bed, and of course, maybe Donnie got up quite a few times getting a few cups of coffees and working on a top, top bunk bed, but you forced him to calm down and cuddle with you guys. <laughs> Excuse me. Good night, you two. I've missed you. I've missed you too, my little possum. 
I miss you too, my little other possum. <laughs> well, good night, my little exotic flower. Good night, purple turtle or lavender man. I like that nickname, he said as his tail wagged. They both clung on to you and you were snuggling the, the two of them. Um, Casey slightly purring and Donnie cheering. And of course, you got Fluffball. And that's all for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. We are trying to get to 10k subscribers. But for now, we're trying to get to 6k subscribers. I hope you guys enjoy the series. I'm going to make a small playlist after I upload this video. It will be the um, Yonder series for Jones and Donnie. You will find that in my playlist section and I will be adding other um, videos to the rest of my playlists and I will put them in order so you can find them more easily like all my John Doe videos, all my Sonic videos, my spicy videos separated like TMNT and others, my Gorillas with the Z the band, 2D videos, Ace, I think I've done Murdoch like in, probably in one of my videos basically putting everything in a separate playlist and yes i'll be doing sal fisher and tiki toby and other creepy posters soon be patient <laughs> my instagram discord link server wattpad soundcloud and the songs that i use will be in the description below so if you are curious on what songs i used it will be on the description and if you have any song suggestions make sure to comment it down below and i'll see you guys in my live stream Bye.